Myrtle Beach, departure Boeing 10 Heavy, IFR2 Jacksonville with Bravo. Boeing 10 Heavy, Jacksonville departure. Good evening, you're clear to the Jacksonville Airport. Read our radar vector, uh, uh, radar vectors Charleston, Char Tang, uh, Charlie Hotel Sierra, then is filed. Maintain 3000, expect 280, tennis departure, departures with me. Squawk 6522. Boeing 10 heavy clear to Jacksonville, radar vectors Charleston, then as filed, climb 3000, expect flight level 2801 zero minutes after, departure with you, squawk 6522. Boeing 10 heavy, read back, correct, push and start, at your discretion, contact me for tax, expect runway 18 for departure. All right, clear for push and start, we'll call for tax, expecting run uh, 18 for departure, and we just have one request for you. Go ahead. Is there any chance we could get an unrestricted climb up to 10,000 feet today? Unable at this time, due to traffic that's overflying the top. Boeing 10 Heavy, roger that, thank you. Fuck. There are wings, 1225 ready for target. I bet Spirit Wings is going to unrestricted climb that bitch. It was worth a shot, though. Uh, th by the way, that was an intensely confusing readback. Okay, so we're cleared up to 3,000 feet. We will adjust that. Squawk code is going to be 6522. Enter. We'll go up to the overhead panel. Turn on our left and right fuel pumps, center pumps as well. We'll go to the engine start switches. We'll start both at the same time, so left and right starter switches are on. And we will come down to the fuel control unit and turn those on as well. Spirit wings 1225. On departure heading 150, runway 18, take off for wings 1225. All right, both engines now up and running. We will go back to the overhead panel, turn off the APU. Um, while we're here, we'll do a quick flight control check. Okay, good flight controls. Test the speed brake as well. Okay, flight controls are good. We are now ready to call for clearance. And we'll do that on approach 127.4. Myrtle Beach departure, Boeing 10 Heavy, ready for taxi with Bravo. Boeing 10 Heavy, runway 18, taxi via Bravo. 18 via Bravo, Boeing 10 Heavy. We will release parking brake, and here we go. All right, and quick departure briefing as we head down to runway 18. We have 9,500 feet available. After departure, we're probably expecting runway headings and vectors to our first waypoint, which is plan. And from there, we'll be proceeding direct to Charleston VOR. Unrestricted climb is not approved. We will keep that in mind. For now, we will continue taxi. Departure Boeing 10 Heavy, ready for takeoff, runway 18. It is 0, nine, zero at 3 upon departure, fly runway heading, runway 18, clear for takeoff. Clear for takeoff, runway 18, runway heading, Boeing 10 Heavy. Okay, on the roll takeoff clearance, landing lights coming on, uh, strobe lights on as well, runway turnoff lights, anti ice is set, flaps set, trim set, final approach clear. Real approach, good evening, and Epic 3 1, looking to pick up VFR for pattern work with Charlie. Epic 31, runway 18, taxi via Bravo. Uh, we're looking to pick up our VFR clearance. There's no VFR clearance on the Charlie if you're staying in the pattern. Oof. Runway 18, taxi via Bravo. Roger, via Bravo, Epic 31. Got some pilots getting served up here in Myrtle Beach. Okay, runway 18 verified. Runway heading up to 3000, here we go. All right, power is set. 80 knots. And 120. V1. Rotate. Positive weight gear is coming up. We're not unrestricted to 10, but we will be unrestricted to 3. We are pitching up full throttle, holding 170. Control 25 degrees on the pitch. Zero heavy, stay up to traffic. Boeing 10 heavy, 2,000 for 3,000. Boeing 10 heavy, radar contact, climb, maintain 10,000. Turn right, direct Charleston, VOR, proceed on course. 10,000, direct Charleston, on course, Boeing 10 heavy.
And there's 3,000. We will level off from our space shuttle status climb back to a 10 degrees pitch, and we will turn right, direct Charleston. Flaps are coming up. Auto throttle is on. We will turn autopilot on now and uh, bump the speed up to 50 and continue with our right turn direct to Charleston. All right, well, that was fun. We got a little bit of an unrestricted climb up there to 3,000 feet and then resumed normal 2,200-foot uh, climb. We're through 8,000 now. Autopilot holding steady. That's a nice change of pace. But there's 10,000 feet we're coming up on, so we'll go ahead to the overhead landing lights off. Do the passenger chime just because. Why not? Boeing 10, contact. One zero heavy, contact X, center 135.92, see ya. Center 135902, Boeing 10 heavy, see ya. 135902, we are now with Jack Center. We'll give them a call, let them know at 10,000 feet. Jack Center, Boeing 10 Heavy with you, 10,000. Boeing 10 Heavy, Jacksonville Center, call and maintain flight level 280. Flight level 280, Boeing 10 Heavy. Carrot, Canadian Express 001, turn right heading 270, just going to maintain 3,000. See the wind 080 at 6. And uh, which runway do you want? Runway 10? Uh, okay, one for Romeo Rogers, turn to the left downwind, runway 10. I want for Rene Roger, uh, the altimeter at Savannah. All right, and we have reached our cruising altitude to flight level 280. We'll go to the overhead panel, turn off the seatbelt sign for our Boeing zero passengers. Boeing 10 descend via the Looney 1 arrival, runway 8 transition, Jacksonville altimeter 3012. Descend Looney 1, runway 8 transition, Boeing 10 heavy. So okay. coming up on top of descent, after that is going to be bench waypoint out to restriction flight level 260 there. So we'll go ahead and begin our descent down to flight level 260 to the overhead panel. Seatbelt sign on, and we'll pull the speed back three zero zero knots as well. And that sun is no longer directly at our twelve o'clock, so we'll bring up the really expensive sun visor. Center okay, through flight level one eight zero, we'll reset altimeter for Jacksonville, according to it's. <laughs> Uh, funny waypoint names. Time, uh, we're coming up on 10,000 feet through uh, 1 3,000 right now. We'll just go ahead and get ahead of the checklist and turn landing lights on so we don't forget about that. We'll pull the power back now to 50 as we approach 10,000 feet and the altitude restriction at Looney. Boeing 10, you can expect the visual approach runway 8. Expect visual runway 8, Boeing 10 heavy. Expect the visual. Would you prefer an ILS for that aircraft or are you okay with the visual approach? Visual approach, no problem. We'll take that, Boeing 10. All right, so we're going to get a visual approach to runway 8. And uh, ideal weather conditions right now in Jacksonville, we have a 10-knot headwind, direct headwind for runway 8. Uh, a few clouds at about 2,000 feet, but I don't think that'll be a factor. We'll have the ILS program just in case, but we're going to hand fly the visual approach. Try to make this the smoothest landing you have ever seen. And center, Southwest 1304, Southwest no 2. Wow. It is in moments like these that I truly realize how far the flight simulation platform has come. FedEx 6681, flight level 3610. FedEx 6681, Jacksonville Center, roger. Uh, Boeing 10 Heavy, turn right heading 260 to center maintain 3000, vectors to final. 260 down to 3000, Boeing 10 Heavy. Put the really expensive sun visor down as well as we are manually holding. Boeing 10 Heavy, turn left heading 160, center maintain 2000. 160 down to 2000, Boeing 10 Heavy. Boeing 10 Heavy, Jacksonville, 10 o'clock at 1 1 mile. Uh, 10 Heavy, we got clouds. We're going to have to take the ILS in. Boeing 10 Heavy, Roger, set to maintain 1900, flight heading 180. 1900 and 180, Boeing 10 Heavy. Man, it'll be nice if we get in the field to sight. But we just do have those clouds that literally, it looks like there's a, the entire world is on fire over there, so. Boeing 10 Heavy, still, still in the clouds there? Yeah, we got like a ridiculously low level just above the airport. Okay. Boeing 10 Heavy, three miles from Denz, maintain 1,900 till established on the localizer, cleared ILS runway 8 approach. Cleared ILS runway 8, Boeing 10 Heavy. Like, what the fuck even is... You know what? This is bullshit. That's not even fair. The clouds are below the ground. Oopsies. Oh, look at that field in sight. Boeing 10 Heavy, contact Jacksonville Tower, 118.3, good day. 
Tower 118.3, thanks for the help, Boeing 10 Heavy, good day. Welcome. Tough left 13, zero, right. 4, 8 miles in trouble. Runway 8 now in sight, uh, we'll go over to boat. Tower 118.3, and uh, we are hand flying this approach in a little bit low on the localizer right now, but we will drop landing gear and then call tower. Jacksonville Tower, Boeing 10 Heavy, visual 8. Boeing 10 Heavy, Jacks Tower. Wind is 080 at 7. Runway 8, clear to land. Clear to land, runway 8, Boeing 10 Heavy. About to see the smoothest landing of your life. We'll go and continue with the flaps. Coming in a little bit hot right now, so we'll throw in a little bit of late speed brakes here. Okay, speed through 160 now. Speed brakes out again. We'll drop that final notch of flaps. And we are clear to land, runway 8. Here we go. Ooh, baby. All right, speed brakes are up. Jackson Tower, right, two in reverse. 04, final, runway eight. Boeing 10 Heavy, uh, make first available right turn, hold short of Alpha, contact ground point nine. Right, when able, shorter Alpha, ground point nine, Boeing 10 Heavy. Wasn't the best landing ever, but I'll take that. Clear of runway eight, traffic coming on the final, just wanna make sure we are actually clear of the runway. Yeah, that counts. Okay, quick after landing check. Um, speed brakes up, south flaps up, off. landing lights off, uh, taxi lights on, strobe Jackson lights Bravo. off, Jacksonville ground Boeing 10 heavy, clear of 8, short of Alpha, uh, request taxi to the main terminal ramp. Uh, American 420, stand by Boeing 10, taxi to the ramp via Alpha Hotel. Alpha Hotel to the ramp, Boeing 10 heavy. All right, we'll make a right turn here on Alpa, and then it'll be a Copy left on hotel, hotel up ahead. Victor Lima, Papa for Welcome to Jacksonville. American 420. God damn, right, the sunset after is Papa, amazing. November oh, we've got landing traffic. Nice. Sector runway 8, Gold, Alpha, Lima. 4 hour Gold. Oh, shit. That guy just ate it pretty hard. Okay, so we're going to park over there on the left side of the ramp, just under the tower, uh, basically where we started on the transatlantic flight to Geneva. Oh, God, we got aircraft taxiing out here. Or just takes out an entire catering crew. Holy shit, guy. R.I.P. Sky Chefs. That's 1304. That guy's getting the hell out of here. Okay, and we are parked to the overhead. Taxi lights off. Beacon light off. And Come down to the center the pedestal and fuel cut off left and right. Having some uh, control issues for American 420. Maintain 3,000. Delta 8257 cleared. Keep hard to check. Anyways, we'll go ahead and clean up the rest of the, rest of the aircraft here. We'll turn off the, the rest of our lights. We'll leave logo lights on and panel lights on. Turn off the battery. We'll just go cold and dark so we don't get the ATC comms anymore. Anyways, that'll be it for this video. We have arrived here in Jacksonville from Myrtle Beach. My main camera died, so I had to improv and record off of my iPhone that I just set on my desk, but at least you actually could kind of see the controls in there, so maybe that worked out. Anyways, uh, thank you to Thrustmaster for sending me these controls to use for this video. I do appreciate it. This video was sponsored by them. Hope you enjoyed the arrival. Full ATC coverage on the way in was pretty nice. Got a little bit messy out there on the approach. Uh, with some interesting weather conditions, but we did end up making it. May or may not have turned off the live weather conditions at the last minute, but that's just a rumor that I heard. That'll be it for this video, though. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. This is Air Force Proud 95, and I will see you next time. Hey, what's up, YouTube? Air Panda 49 here. Merch is available. Air Force Proud 95.store. Top secret code BUTTER for 15% off for the rest of the year. That'll be it for me, though. Thank you for watching the video. Hope you enjoyed it. I will see you next time. Jacksonville Clearance. Good evening, Boeing Niner Heavy IFR2 Geneva with Alpha. Uh, sir, this is a Wendy. Okay, can we stop doing that, please? You are upsetting the pandas. I bet you never thought you'd be watching a guy play Flight Simulator as he eats fettuccine Alfredo. Weird shit happening right now.